Oh hey wonderful humans, welcome back to another tutorial on how to connect card.co and your Google Analytics. I'm currently making this new product, Educreator OS. It's amazing, it's going to be helpful for all the people who want to share educational content using Notion templates. Uh, check it out. But right now it doesn't have any Google Analytics on it, so I'm going to show you how to get that set up. Google Analytics recently updated to Google Analytics 4 from 3, so there's a couple changes. Currently, you can see there's no data in here. That's kind of annoying. Um, what you're going to want to do is move this talking head and get into the admin section. Here there's already a little pop-up for go to stream setup, but you might not see this. If you go to admin and choose the property that you want, or if you don't have the property, create a new property, go through that setup. Um, once you're here, you want to go to data settings, data stream, sorry, move the talking head and click on web. Once you're here, you can boop, take your URL. So mine is educreatoros.com. Let's grab all of that, plop it in there delete the HTTPS because that's already there and call it a thing um, edu creator dash OS website website dyslexia create the stream and voila magic um, you want this thing copy that Come over to Educreator OS or your website and click the publish button. It's not actually going to publish, so go over to where are you? There, Google Analytics. This is in the settings tab. Paste that in there, hit publish. Dun, dun, dun. And fingers crossed, there's some data in Google Analytics. Let's go view that. Pretty, 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 pretty cool. But what we really want to see is this. If I refresh Google Analytics, elevator music commencing in three, two, Cool. Um, now I want to go back to the home page. And here, I now have a happy dashboard, but no users. So go view it. That's how you set it up.